Hello, welcome to Woodland Honeycomb. We are installing a package of bees today and I've got my lovely assistant Andrea, my sister, and my dad back there, but he doesn't want to be in the video. So I guess it's just me. So first we're going to take out this can of sugar water that this package of bees comes with. It's to feed them so they could stay in the package for a couple of days. And then this hole kind of releases the bees a little bit. And then the next thing we want to do is scoop out the queen who comes in a little cage. And the bees are going to want to follow the queen wherever she goes. So there's probably going to be a lot of bees stuck to the cage if I can get it out. There we go. There's bees under that can. Oh, sorry bees. Yeah, don't set it down. So. I'll put you right there. And I'll come show the camera what it looks like. So there's a queen in there. All these worker bees have been tending to her the last couple days, getting her food, getting her water. So now I gotta shake off these bees. And then in the corner right there, there's a little cork. And I have to pull that out and put a little stick of candy in there. So here's a little stick of candy. You replace this with the cork and the bees eat through the candy to slowly release the queen. This gives um, the bees the opportunity to get to know the queen before she's released. Cause if they don't like her, they'll kill her. So it's important that they have time to get to know her first. So I'm just gonna shake them off a little bit inside the hive. <laughs> the queen's alive in there, you can see she's running around. So now I'm just gonna take some needle nose pliers. Actually, I'm gonna hold the candy too. It's kind of hard to hold so many things while you're holding little bugs that can sting you and you gotta be kind of fast so the queen doesn't pop out uh-huh then the bees will eat through this little tunnel of candy and then the queen will crawl out being the queen looks good and healthy so now we're gonna take this little cage and we're gonna tape it to a frame so she doesn't fall and get lost in there. So I've got a little piece of tape that I'm going to stick on there. Bigger? Thank you. I'm going to undo this metal part too. Because that kind of is a little bit of an anchor for her. Hold on. So I'll do that. Tape her on, make sure she's really secure. And then I'm just gonna take this box. I don't think it's gonna fit. Actually, yeah, I think I'm gonna put scoot the bees over a little. You're gonna smush all those worker bees. space right here for the queen and taper right there. We might have to take out another frame so everybody everybody can fit. We might need another piece of tape. You're gonna have to come get it. <laughs> okay. These bees are the Carniolan, I think is how you pronounce it. And they're supposedly really, really friendly. I've had these for the past couple years and I've only been stung like a couple times. They're really sweet and docile. What about the bees? Are in, the, in the box, can you scoop them out? I'm just gonna be really gentle putting it in there. Try not to squish anybody. 
And then I'm just going to put on the hive lid, which is this, tuck them all in. And then in 24 hours, I'm gonna come check and see if the, the queen bee is released and take out that box and put the rest of our frames in. And that's pretty much it. Super easy, didn't get stung at all. That was awesome. Thanks for joining us. <laughs>